Hey guys, so before we start the Nintendo DIY, I just wanted to say that today's video is sponsored by Skillshare, our very first sponsor. I am very thankful for this opportunity. Basically, Skillshare is an online community where you can learn different classes and skills that can definitely up your game when it comes to content creating. Like I said, there are thousands of different classes on Skillshare, such as entrepreneurship, marketing, design, and of course my personal favorite, fine art. I highly recommend Rachel and Daniel's DIY product photography class. It's where I learned how to shoot all my DIYs after completing the tutorial. That way you guys can see all the fine details. The first 1,000 people to use the link in my description will get a free trial of Skillshare Premium Membership. After that, it's only 10 bucks a month for as many classes as you like. If you want to support our channel and you want to up your skills when it comes to content creating, I highly recommend you check out the link down below and of course definitely try out Skillshare. Huge thank you again to Skillshare. Welcome to the next Nintendo DIY. This is inspired by Valentine's Day. And if you need an Animal Crossing New Horizons card, I believe these are perfect. These are all free and this will be down below in the description. Free for you to print out, cut out, and use at your own discretion. I hope you guys enjoy all these different various cards that I've created. And if you want to actually glue something inside the car, I provided this free printout sheet with the various items that you can use to decorate your card even more. So again, if you guys happen to make this Nintendo DIY, Nerd DIY, or any DIY on my channel, definitely hashtag it on my social media, and I would love to share it in the next video. So when it comes to this Nintendo DIY, right now I'm using cardstock, and the size is actually much bigger, but for this tutorial, I've decided to cut the cards in half. If you need to do that, I highly recommend using Photoshop, otherwise it'll actually take up an entire piece of paper. The hardest thing is to cut in a straight line, so I highly recommend this straight cutter. If you do not have one, I will list one down below in the description. That way you guys can get your own, just in case if you plan on making more cards. Once you've decided the cards that you want to use from the Animal Crossing New Horizons collection, go ahead and cut out the items that you'd like to paste inside of the cards. This is definitely one of my favorite designs, and I think it's perfect when it comes to really adding more decorative pieces to the cards. All these Nintendo DIYs are for you guys, so I highly recommend be as creative as possible and do whatever you want. When it comes to cutting out the shapes, please be very, very careful. Of course, if you're not of age, ask your older brother, sister, mom, or dad to help you out. Once you've cut out all the shapes that you'd like to use, it's time to glue them inside the card. So for this specific card, it's totally perfect because I'm totally digging you it is definitely a reference from Animal Crossing New Horizons. You dig up fossils, and the coolest thing is that when you open in this card you'll not only see the fossil but you'll see the hole and of course the shovel that is used in Animal Crossing. I think it's one of my favorite cards from the bunch but let me know down below in the description which one is yours. So any type of craft glue will do. I will try to list a lot of them down below in the description so you guys can choose from various types. The only kind of tips I'll recommend when it comes to gluing these pieces on is making sure that the layer isn't too thick. You don't want the glue to seep over the edge. You definitely want a clean look to these cards. So what you can do is wipe off any excess glue that you have and make sure again that it's a thin layer. I decided to make these Animal Crossing New Horizons Valentine's Day cards completely free because I believe, especially this year, we need more love, which is basically unconditional, unlimited, and like I said, it's free. So if you can, make as many as you want and give them away to your family and friends this year. Again, love is free and just like these cards, it'll make everyone just feel very warm and loved. Speaking of loved, I absolutely loved all these Nintendo DIY, so huge shout out to everyone who shared their current creations and crafts. If you want to be featured in the next video, all you have to do is go to my social media, Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook, share it with me, and of course, hashtag it Nintendo DIY. I'll see it and feature it in the next video. I just want to say happy Valentine's Day, amigos and amigals. And if you've already subscribed, I will definitely see you next time.